guys thanks so much for watching my tutorial I'm super excited to show you how I got this gorgeous gold cranberry eye look I've never actually put these colors before and I couldn't wait to share them with you guys I did wear this for a day and I had so many compliments and I go what better than to just make a tutorial and show everybody out there how like such good talent and creation this actually came out using these two colors together in this tutorial, I do have to say that I'm going to be talking through it, which I've never done in any of my tutorials for AI look. So let me know what you guys think of that thumbs up if you do like it. Also, comment down below too as well. And if you haven't yet, please subscribe because I've got some awesome, awesome giveaway videos that are going to be coming up soon. So enjoy watching and let me know what you guys think. Okay, so I'm going to start by using my Too Faced Shadow Insurance Primer. I um, really, really like this primer. It helps smooth out the eyeshadow and completely just um, keeps it on all day without having to retouch. Which I think is always super important and if you haven't used an eyeshadow primer yet, I definitely recommend on getting one. And you can see that it just goes on like completely clear. Next I'm going in, it's the NYX Gold Cream Shadow, which these do dry pretty quickly, so I do suggest working pretty fast with it. So using the doe foot applicator, you're just going to do it a little below the crease for the highest point. You don't want to put this in the crease because when you mix a shadow and powder together, it kind of looks like it's like a little bit of that creepy effect. And all I'm doing is just dipping it in one time, that's all you need. my finger just to smooth it out. Next I'll be going in with my Lancome palette and the first color with my blender brush I'm going to be using the cranberry color which is called Du Joie. I don't know. I don't know how to say it. <laughs> so I'm going to be starting right at the corner of the crease here, a little above and just giving a really nice blend right in the crease just to be a little bit more of that transition shade so when you start to smoke it out with the black it's going to be a lot easier so remember you don't want to hit the cream eyeshadow too much with the powder and same thing going in with my other eye going in to actually create that sharp nice clean edge in your shadow you want to actually take just this eyelash glue um, and you want to just press the product like from the corner to the eye to the end of the brow this will help give that sharp edge and I'm using the blackout color by Lancome in the palette and I'm now just going to start to do a raid at the corners of the eye And then I'm going to blend it right in with the cranberry color. After that, I'm going back in with the Du Joie cranberry color and going right over the black with it just to give it a nice blend. Now you actually just created that sharp edge. Hold in the applicator just like so. Going in a little bit with the blackout color by Lancome. Right after that, we're going back in with the Du Joie color and putting it right over the black. The NYX glitter. We're going to glam this up a little bit. 
just to give it some pop. So this is actually only going to go over the gold itself. And just blotting it like so. Evenly distributing it throughout the whole lid. And just only bringing it up to right where the gold cream shadow ends. Make sure that your eyes are set down so this way you're not creasing any of the glitter onto the black. Glitter! I love glitter, it's so fun. Okay, so I'm just going to let that set into place because it is a little wet. So now it's set and I'm going to be going in with my liquid liner Intense Black by Stila. A thin line to get it prepped for my lashes. recommend these NYX cream shadows. They're absolutely amazing and I'm so happy that I discovered them. Okay, so I'm now going to be placing my lashes onto my liquid liner and placing it right at the top of the liner and going in with my next lash and just lightly placing the lashes right on top of the liquid liner. So, okay, so my lashes are prepped and ready. Now I'm going to be going in with a cargo eyeliner pencil in Black Sea, and I'm just going to be lining the inner waterline of my eyes. The Dujoir color, which is the cranberry and I'm be smudging it right underneath my eye. And I'm gonna bring it in right with the wing of my liner too, just to close it up and give it more of a smoky effect. I didn't show this in one of the corners of the video, but the Cargo 3 Triple Action Mascara. This is uh, my favorite mascara right now. It thickens, lengthens, and curls, and it's literally like a comb for your lashes. So I'm gonna start just by doing underneath the fake lashes and just doing the bottom ones a little bit. So this is it, your final look. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. As you guys noticed, I did use Cargo Cosmetics and I'm using it for a reason because pretty soon I'm gonna be doing my first giveaway video. And um, I will definitely give you guys all the information when I'm gonna be launching it so you get yourself prepared because I would love for everybody to participate. So far you guys have been awesome and thank you so much for watching and all your likes. Thank you.